Circle of Friends reaches out to children, teens, and young adults with disabilities and involves them in a whole array of social experiences, home visits, trips, and inclusive social opportunities. In addition, it empowers hundreds of high school teen volunteers to bring friendship to these children and teens with special needs. Circle of Friends is really a double blessing. It's obviously a blessing for the families and the children who need the services that it provides, but it's really also a blessing for all the kids who have the opportunity to get involved and help someone else and connect with a child they might not otherwise encounter. My son, when he was diagnosed, we found out about it through friends of ours. It's such a unique program. It's so hard to find. We're so lucky to have it. I think that unless you're in this situation, you don't realize how hard it is for kids with special needs to get that social time. It's been for balance. It's been beneficial for me because I'm always looking for experiences for my son to have a social interaction with someone. So my brother Patton has autism. He's always had trouble making friends. Can you drop into the menu? In school, he doesn't do regular recess or regular gym or really take any of the other classes other kids take. He's really one-on-one -on -one almost the whole day in school, so it's very hard for him to have any interaction to develop a friendship. So this really gives him that experience. It's really helped our family tremendously to see the growth in him socially. It's invaluable for him to have that experience. It's really, really hard to find. Ethan's my best friend. Thanks, Ben. You're my best friend, too. This has been a great experience for my son, Ethan, particularly the one-on-one -on -one experience with Patton because it's really helped bring out his nurturing side and given him an opportunity to use his empathy and his patience and his love. There you go, Ben. I've learned how to treat people and how to make sure that everyone's included. You get to understand uh, how different people think and you get to make friendships that are gonna last you a really long time. Todd, how's your day today? At every educational symposium, the number one question is how do we empower our youth to feel a sense of responsibility for community? And the answer is give them a truly meaningful volunteer experience. With Circle of Friends, I've gotten a sense of perspective by volunteering. I now see the troubles some people with disabilities have with finding friends, and I'm so happy to be able to provide friendship for them. You can put like this much in it. It's really meaningful experience for the teens without special needs and for the teens with special needs because then they have a friend that comes here twice every month, and they really get a good experience out of this too with a friend that they would sometimes not normally have. If you can engage teenagers, youth, in their formative years and give them an impactful volunteer experience, they will grow up to be our future caring leaders and benefactors. I really encourage my friends to come to volunteer at Circle of Friends because it really changes you as a person and your outlook on life. Circle of Friends has taught me to be more accepting of different kids and I think it would help like different kids at school to like be accepting of people who aren't so similar to us and accept their differences. Everybody needs friends but for Patton and people like Patton it's not that easy to make friends at school so this is like a more intimate experience where he can have a good friend in his life. It's really fulfilling and I love it. Go for it! Circle of Friends needs your support to continue providing social opportunities for children and teens with special needs and to include every single child who needs a friend. There are so many children and teenagers with special needs waiting for friendship, seeking social opportunities. And until we can include every single child and teen, our work is not complete. You know, when I started Circle of Friends, I thought it was going to be a one-time thing. I would set up a play date between a teenager and a child with special needs, and I was going to do something very nice. And before I knew it, parents were calling me, can my child have a play date? And volunteers were calling me, 
I would love to volunteer, I would love to get involved, and it just grew and grew. No matter how large the circle grows, it never changes. It just gets bigger and bigger and bigger, but it always retains its unique shape. It never ends. And that's really what Circle of Friends is, because friendship never ends. It lasts forever. There is no one who gets involved with Circle of Friends and does not leave inspired and uplifted. That's the power of friendship. That's the power of Circle of Friends.